Hey guys, it's Selene here with Cowboy. Okay, we're gonna be on WikiHow again. Okay, I'm gonna type in Briar once again. Okay. <laughs> B R E Y. How to play with you, Briar? I didn't know you had to. Okay. Um, I watched Infinity Briar do this. That's who inspired me. But I think she did How to Play with You, Briar first. But like, I'm gonna do it now. So yeah. <laughs> okay. It just yeah okay perfect okay okay tile mm -hmm. oh, boy don't mind them okay so how to play with your prior horse I don't care about that step one know how to care for a bar horse after purchase and during play good care of the horse will ensure that it lasts a long time Read how to care for a bride horse to begin with. Okay, setting up the bride horse home. The bride horse is home. Okay. Build a barn. Think ahead. And if you are planning to own two or more horse bride horses, build a three stall barn. If you are planning to own just one briar, briar, then Build a two stall. Just one bright, then build a two stall barn. It's always nice to have a stall, a spare stall, just in case an emergency comes up. If possible, build the briar barn with a loft that is strong enough to hold a lot of hay and supplies, such as a wheelbarrow, barrow, some buckets, of course. Hey, of course, hey. Maybe even some tack. A room dedicated to tack can help make sure you don't lose it. So, yeah, that's what it said. Lay down. Oh, wait. We are not on to you. <laughs> We're filming right here. We have cowboys stall right here. <laughs> Lay down the thick. Okay, we're gonna skip two. What is happening? Okay, don't look yet. Okay. So, I'm not putting anything in here. It's just nice, clean, little flooring. So, yeah. Let's see? Nice little flooring so we're not going to skip step two okay oh we're, we weren't even playing with the briar horse yet wait hang on hang on he, he's got to say something oh don't look at my hand please don't I am mad. And I did flip. Okay. Part two of two. Playing with your briar horse. Pretend that your briar horse is a real horse. Okay. I put, but what is happening to his face? This just came off. Oh my god. Okay. Can we zoom out or zoom in? Okay. First, for the purposes of playing with it, pretend you're not looking. Pretend when you're not looking, the horse comes out from its pose, either if it's running, jumping, or standing there, or laying down. Pretend that it can wait. Yeah, pretend that it can move its legs. Needs real care. 
needs real care. Mm, yes, it does. Once you're okay with this, the remaining steps are all about playing with the horse as if they were real. Oh, I'm not looking. Hmm. Nick. Okay, you can see Wiki how. <gasps> oh my gosh, okay. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, feed your bride two times. Okay. That's nice. No lunch. Okay. Depending on its size, age, 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 and life of your briar, you'll need to feed your horse a grain at least once a day. Oh, I'm not looking anymore. Ha ha ha. Make pretend grains for the horse. It could be barley, oats, corn, or a mix. You could, you also. You could also use pellet food. Oh my god. Make sure your briar has hay when eating its grain. It helps the horse really horse pro to digest its food better. Provide a toy bucket. Always make sure your horse has access to water. In the cold winter months, make sure, pretend to use heated water buckets for a briar horse so the water does not freeze. Oh my god. I don't play with them like that. I, I like I play with them like like Oh I love you so much, cowboy. And he's like, no, no. Yeah. So yeah. Step two. Groom your butt. Okay. Oh god. Uh, okay, I'm not very happy. How many do we have? Seven? Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, there's seven? Oh my god, okay. Fine. Okay, y'all can read this by yourself. No, I'm just kidding. Groom your bar horse daily or at least every other day. Start with a curry comb, then go to the bristle brush. Then use a face brush on his face and pick out the hoof, and if necessary, put on a pretend hoof flex. A liquid that helps your horse's hooves look nicer and make them stronger. It's almost like a jacket and blanket for your horse's hooves. Only use small to accessory brushes and do not scrape along or dig into the horse when grooming or you will likely leave marks on it, the plastic. If it is hot and your horse is done riding, you may need to cool it off by spraying the horse gently with a fake hose. Make sure your horse is tied or you have something holding its lead while you wash it. Okay. We have the tack room and the wash. Yes, okay. Keep the horse warm. We're not going to go into that. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> yeah, she's right there. <laughs> she has a blanket on. I tried, okay? I tried. So, it's not snowing, so. <laughs> Can we look at the brighter? Does she, have, does she have gray hair? Oh, God. That looks like Caitlin. <laughs> okay, keep the horse insect free. In the summer, your husband needs fly spray and a fly mask when going out in the pasture to keep the in irritating flies away from your horse. Try buying a fly mask from my briar store because homemade ones usually don't end up as planned. Oh my god. You are welcome to make your own fly mask, but remember, fly mask doesn't have eye holes and is made of netting, not felt or cloth. God. Make sure... God, I'm sorry. Make sure your horse can see through the fly mask's Without having eye holes. Make sure the fly mask fits well. And does not poke your horse's eyes. Wait, hang on. That was the horse, not me. Hmm. Get a rider for a horse. 
if you have a doll rider for a briar, that's great. If you do, if you do have a rider, make sure you have a bridle that fits your briar. A doll can't ride without a bridle. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Sure. Have the rider ride the horse at least twenty minutes a day. If not, your horse gets. If not, you can still make sure your horse gets enough exercise. Maybe try lunching your briar horse. It is recommended that you have tack <laughs> and saddle pads <laughs> and extra halters. <laughs> extra halters. But if you don't have a saddle or, saddle or anything. Or anything, you just ride bear pack. You should lunge, lodge, 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 lodge your horse if you don't ride for at least 15 minutes a day to get your horse's energy out. I don't know what lodge means. <laughs> God, I don't know what lodge means. Like, look. Maybe it means, um, lunge, but, like, I don't know, so. Yeah. Keep the mares and stallions apart. Well, she's right there and he's right here, so, yeah. If you have two mares, if you have two mares, where I am I? Okay, yeah. Keep them. If you own two briars and one is stallion and one is a mare, separate them when they graze. Otherwise, you may, might end up having a fool in your hands. Unless you want this to happen. If you have two mares, it's okay to leave them together just as long as they get along. Usually, mares will get along sometimes, but sometimes they don't. Check on them to make sure the non-dominant horse is getting enough to eat, and some horses will chase others for, from the food. If you have two stallions, you could keep them together, too. Just keep a close eye on them, because stallions, stallions, you could, stallions can be aggressive if there's a mare in the picture. If you have two foals, make sure they are with their mothers until they are one year old. Also, don't allow your doll to ride your foal until it is at least four years old. If you have a gelding, keep it with any of your horses, whether it's a mare, stallion, mare, stallion, foal, or other gelding. You can have three mares together in one pasture with two foals that are with their mothers. One foal could be a filly, one a colt. If you have a stallion and a gelding in another pasture, everyone gets along. Okay. Well, oh, step eight. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Um, what is that? Okay. Um, what? The heck? Nuh -uh, not gonna happen. Why am I taking you? Bad cowboy. Bad boy. I mean, good cowboy. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Okay, no, 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 uh, nope, nope. <laughs> don't do that. Okay. So, play Step 8. Play all with your brow horses. Make up your own storylines. Get out of here. For the... Things your horses get up to, including going to horse shows, escaping from the pasture, falling in horse love, nope, not gonna happen, no, <laughs> fighting the rider, frightening the rider. Getting sick well again. Getting sick in well again. <laughs> I'm alright. 
<laughs> and so forth. Okay. So, that's all. Yeah, okay, that's nice. Okay, I'm just looking at this. Wait, what does that say? My seven was just broke. I have this on my Okay, well, nice. That's nice. Okay, well, we. Oh my god, I didn't even know it was like leaning like that. Oh my god. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. <laughs> and um, uh, make sure to subscribe. Please. Please. Okay. Oops. Uh, one other thing. This, this, this little guy right there. Mm -hmm. And woman, um, that's so far away. Uh, I... That fencing? is not enough room for him. Do you see? Do you see my problem? Yeah. They should be together. Bye. Thanks. What am I saying? Bye.